Good morning, guys. Another episode of Day in the Life of Flex Dieter Eric Johnson. How y'all doing today? I need to find my shades. I, I left in my wife's car or something. Um, I'm away to the gym. Today's refeed Friday, April 25th, 2014. Got my refeed, extra carbs. Pretty stoked about it. You saw. You see this morning, right? Yeah, I ate that uh, Puff Kamut. It's like five servings of Puff Kamut and then about 28 grams of uh, cookie crisps. Oh, Frank got me all one uh, cookie crisp from over at Bodybuilding Bros. He had some on one of his videos I was watching yesterday during cardio and damn it. Sure enough, I went and uh, grab some of my kids crew cookie crisps that's good though it's all good add a little salted caramel and pancake syrup on there it went to town it was good a little bit of almond milk and also I had that uh, MTS peanut butter fluff POV cake I think it came around you'll see the macros right there it's like 50 50 protein something like that Eight carbs, four fats, five fats, something like that. I don't know. Just you saw. Them. Anyway, so yeah, that's that was my breakfast. I'm gonna go train, and then I'm gonna come back and to my mom's house and make some of that uh, protein. And then put some uh, puff kamut on there. And then I don't know. Sandwich. I got some good stuff. I think I'm making uh chicken pot pie tonight so y'all get to y'all get to see me watch make that cook that uh chicken pot pie maybe i'll make a how-to video on that chicken pot pie because it's pretty damn tasty my kids like it and shit actually the one i'm making tonight's a little bit different than the one i made on, on pie day if you saw the pie day video to celebrate pie 3.14 day um that one i used the campbell chicken cream of chicken soup or something like that you know the chicken soup one cream of chicken healthy version whatever but today I'm changing it up because you know I'm all about that Cali baby I'm using Cali as my base soup in my pot pie yeah it's on baby it's gonna be good I'm not sure what spices I'm gonna use yet. Probably some adobo and stuff. I'm down. I'm down with the adobo. All right, that's all. I got some hyper chested or hyper upper actually. So I got chest back, and I got to do some other and some shoulder work and shit like that. Buys and tries, but uh, on my back, that's, I totally jacked it up on Monday laying in bed for a long time and shit over the weekend so I have to um, I gotta do a test drive video on that new Corvette that ain't slick that's what I just saw right now um, I gotta change up my routine a little bit I usually today I would be doing some uh, bent over rows hyper hyper day so it'll be slow eccentric but I can't I can't do a bent over row right now so I'll probably do um, maybe T-bar or something like that. Something supporting my upper body to get it going on. And then, of course, I could do my pull-ups or weighted pull-ups or whatever. Pull-downs or whatever. So I'm good there. I just got to change up. Change it up a little bit. That's how it works. Is that better? All right, guys. That's all. Once I get out of the gym, I'll get my protein made up. And we'll chat, hopefully. If my mom doesn't have a bunch of people over. Later.
man, guys, y'all see that big old bowl? It was like, it was 10 cups of that protein. I used 280 grams of frozen strawberries and one and a half servings of chocolate casein domatize and uh, a couple grams of xanthan gum and I did it bodybuilding bro style where I mixed up my almond milk and wet in casein and xanthan and then kept it in the fridge all day that's just legit, man. You sit there, you blend up your stuff, blend up your frozen stuff, and then shove that in there. Add a little bit more water. Makes it smooth. Smooth, man. Smooth protein. It's badass shit. You need to try that out. You can check it out if you need details. I think they did a video on how you actually do it or whatever. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it also. But uh, that's definitely a way to, way, way to go. Then, I topped it off with some Kamut, some cinnamon, and Walter Farms junk. Tore into it. Van is off. You want to say hi, Van? Hi. Van's off of school. He got off early today, so I had to pick him up, and then we went to my office. I did some now shit. My now he's watching Frozen. Hashtag Frozen Attic back there. But, uh, man, I got to work, man. I started doing all my work, trying to rush through it and everything because wasn't having a good time there. So, got what I had to get done, done, and then burned out of there. Got on the road, realized I didn't eat my dang lunch. So, I got a chicken Sammy sitting in the icebox over there because I took it out of my, uh, lunch kit a carry kit and uh so anyway so yeah it's over there so that means I got more macros to play with now I had it all lined out today everything was lined out but now I got probably 40 protein 20 carbs and a couple fats maybe something like that I don't know what I'm doing with figure something out hi right, guys later did y'all see that protein I forgot to tell y'all about it. Did y'all see the, the big ass bowl? I used a punch bowl. Look at the three different bowls right here. Y'all see that? So the, the one on the right is a regular bowl, cereal bowl. And then the one in the middle, that's the five cup Pyrex that I usually use for my massive Eatings, and then I blew that damn protein up, man, up with all that frozen fruit. Killed it, and the macros are legit. It was pretty. It was pretty epic. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Anyway, that's all. I just blended up some uh, protein with that there peanut butter fluff. Boom. Some pretty good stuff. Check it out. <whistles> Protein, baby. It's tasty, boy. It's nice and creamy, and I mean, it's just like almost like marshmallow. It's more like marshmallow with a hint of peanut butter. I think that's why fluff is before peanut butter. What do y'all think? Pretty good. I'm gonna go sit down and eat. What's up, guys? So I just sat down with my peanut butter fluff protein. With my strawberry magic pops. We got big them things is. Mmm. So it's really called fluff peanut butter because it's all fluffy and marshmallowy. With the hint of peanut butter, 
That's what it's about. What's up, buddy? What's up, guys? This is my final meal. Went with a chicken pot pie topped with biscuit. See, we did it for the family as well. It's got all kind of good mi micros in there. I used a cauliflower soup as my base instead of a starch. See, there's a starchy. Boom. That's it, man. Taking our place at the table right now. And we are gonna say grace and get our grub on. This is the last meal of the day. Y'all have a good one. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and all the good stuff, guys. Later.